Hey, what is up everybody? It's Gaijin Invader and in this video I will be talking about uh, my Mercedes A-Class and uh, some common problems I've, um, I've had with it lately and that is the um, ABS, SRS, ESP, BAS lights that appear on the dashboard uh, while I'm driving and also limiting me to 50 kilometers an hour. So um, now I have the, the car's ignition on, on and if I turn on the engine um, the arrow should come up. Uh, let's hope they do come up. And there we go fellas, the arrows I was talking to you about. ESP, ABS, BAS and ESP again. So basically none of the safety features of Mercedes are working at the moment and uh, I'm also limited to 50 kilometers an hour top speed. It doesn't matter what gear I'm in, I've tested it on the road. So uh, it's pretty impossible to pinpoint where this um, uh, error is coming from because these are uh, systems with uh, a lot of modules and sensors and it's quite complicated to you know go one by one and eliminate them physically so for this job um, I've decided to use a scan tool and uh, the scan tool I'm using is from iCarsoft okay so now if I go into the diagnostics section of the iCarsoft I gotta choose my car make and model first Let me shut off the engine so you can hear me better. And um, I choose my car model. It's a Mercedes A Class W169. Diesel. And I prefer to use the smart scan in this situation. So it will scan through all the car modules this specific vehicle has. Okay, so now we have all the uh, modules here and we can see there is 16 of them in this specific vehicle. And let's for example access the um, engine management. And we can see which specific uh, module it is, the model and the make. We can also read fault codes. Uh, yeah, I'm aware of that. It's a glow plug on the third cylinder. But I don't think I'm going to replace it. It's not worth it. Um, but what what we're interested in is um, the stability control, meaning the ESP and ABS system. So now, if I go and read the codes for the errors, it says rotor L6 forward slash one left front speed sensor. And that's that's what we're interested in. So basically, left front speed sensor means the the ABS sensor on the left front wheel. That's pretty straightforward. And if if I had to guess um, where the error was coming from, it would take me hours and hours. And even if I knew it was an ABS problem, then I would have to go and check it really individually. So now I know exactly where the problem is. And what I find really interesting is if I go into live data. And I go to ESP sensors. Here, uh, hold on, hold on, not ESP. Uh, if I go to RPM sensors, here I can see in real time what every like uh, wheel sensor is reading at the moment. And as you can see, left front is acting a bit weird because at the moment I'm in the car, is stationary, and uh, it is it is picking up speed it is picking up data and showing as I'm as if I'm moving at the moment and you see all the other three sensors 
ABS sensors, front right etc. They're at zero, which is correct because I'm not moving. But this specific one sporadically reads uh, data. And uh, it is definitely triggering up the ESP system, the electronic stability control system of uh, the Mercedes. Hence, I'm getting uh, all the errors on the dashboard as ABS and ESP. So, um, I'm 99.9% .9 the error is coming from that and I'm replacing it immediately. And uh, I'm pretty sure the uh, ABS error uh, will disappear immediately. Because we can see this is this is uh, a broken sensor. It's not working as it should. Thanks a lot for watching this video, and I hope you subscribe and like this video um, so I can you know keep more videos coming. Bye.